Welcome to our Christmas Party House Tour. To celebrate the end of the year 2020, we're going to have a giveaway for two pets that have given us a really good year, the Robo Dog and the Frost Fury. So we are going to pick two lucky people, one to receive a Frost Fury and the other a Robo Dog. To enter, follow the instructions in the video. There are four things you need to do. Winners will be announced on the 5th of January 2021. Good luck everyone and a happy new year to you all. So we built this house for the picnickers to enjoy a Christmas party. And it's obviously the luxury apartments has got lots of different levels so we can have lots of fun. This was the swimming pool that we changed into a like an obstacle course. We had to jump over the penguins to get up to the present at the end. And the first person to get up to the present could win a prize. We gave away four fossil eggs for when we were doing the party. I love this entranceway. Obviously there wasn't a lot of Adopt Me furniture for Christmas this year, so we had to design everything by ourselves. This first room was a bit of a fun park. We used the bouncy castles and put them on the walls and combined them with a human cannon. So when you shot yourself out of the human cannon, you'd bounce all over the walls. It was great fun. A really great way to start a party off. In this next little small room, we put the ball pits and the bouncy castles together so you could jump up and down in the ball pits and then climb up on top of the trees here. This room was a tribute to our Mega Frost Theory. We were the first YouTube channel to feature the first Neon and the first Mega Neon Frost Theory. We're really proud of it, so we built a little room to celebrate him. First up, you need to be subscribed to us. So if you're not already, you know what to do. The second floor was all about obbies. Gabby, the picnicker, loves to build obbies, so she built one for the picnickers to enjoy during a Christmas party. It was lots of fun. There's a big Christmas tree in the middle that we all got to climb on as well. And we were the decorations on the tree. There's three different obbies, a large one in the big room, and then two smaller ones. third floor was all about photos, group photos. So we built three different areas that people could have their photos taken and then they could tag us and put it on their social media so that we could all share their Christmas magic together. This one was based on a snow globe that was inside a big glass room with a Christmas tree and a park bench. It made really nice photos for everyone to take. Then the third area was the gingerbread man area. Obviously gingerbreads are quite prominent in the Adopt Me furniture, so we thought we'd build a gingerbread man and a gingerbread area to celebrate Christmas.
And this little room is all about my pet, Mashi G, my giraffe. I've managed to make him into a neon. My aim for next year is a mega neon. Mushy G features heavily on our Discord channel. He's a bot on our Discord channel that you can talk to. And most of the questions you can ask him, he'll say no to. He's really funny. But occasionally, you might get a yes out of him. Merry Christmas, Mushy G. Stop saying no all the time. Next, you're going to need to follow us on Instagram. We're at Picnic Players. The fourth floor was another game area. It was a find the word game. People had to take out their balloons, they weren't allowed any pets. Then we would call out a word and everyone had to rush and jump on top of the word as quick as they could. There was two teams, the reds and the greens. And whichever team got the most people onto the words at once, won the prize. We try and create lots of fun new games to enjoy in Adopt Me, so when we do our builds, there's always something new for people to experience. This area was a little quiz room sparkly quiz room. So again, the greens and the reds, they went up against each other and we had to answer questions about Adopt Me and about picnic players and whoever got the most answers right got to climb to the top of the stars and they won. And this next room was all about making your Christmas wish. People made lovely wishes. Did you make a Christmas wish this year? Did it come true? Finally, we got up to the fifth floor, Santa's Grotto. Christmas party wouldn't be the same without meeting Santa. So where this was Santa's Grotto where everyone got to write letters they could post the letters off to Santa and make sure that they got their right Christmas present. Obviously we had to have Santa's reindeer with us as well. Can't have Santa without his reindeer. So we built a little reindeer area for Santa to keep his reindeers while he was busy giving the presents out. Into Santa's den then, here's Santa's sofa, a really nice room, lots of Christmas trees around. Santa got to give out a load of presents, here's Sevy dressed as Santa, that wasn't the Santa on the day, but he's given me a Christmas gift, thanks Sevy, Santa Sevy. Then, you're going to have to get on our Discord channel. The link is in the description. So this was a room to celebrate us making the first ever Mega Robo Dog. Lovely new pet that came out from Adopt Me. And we were the first YouTube channel to make a Robo Dog into a Mega Neon. Really cool pet. Obviously it's a Robux pet, but we really like it. So we had to make a little room just to celebrate him. This may seem like an ordinary room, just a pet's pantry where we keep our supplies for levelling up pets, but it's got a magical gateway that goes up to our glitch area.
make sure you leave a comment with your Roblox username and be sure to like this video. Welcome then to our Christmas fair. We've built this glitch area to make it look like a Christmas fair. We've got loads of decorations in there, some shops, ice skating, snowball fights, a disco, and of course a Frost Fury Spa. So these were the little shops where you could get something to drink, you could get something to eat. We had a little game going on as well where you could uh, win a prize. There's a little clothes stall, a pizza area and a donut shop. And you could also go and hire your skates for when you want to get on to do the ice skating. This is our pretend ice skating rink. Obviously we couldn't actually create a real one. So it's best to use pogo sticks to jump around, but it gives the fun desired effect. And this is our Frost Fury Hot Spring. So some of the only furniture that came out in the Adopted Christmas update was based around the Frost Fury and statues and snowflakes and plants. So we used that to build a really cool hot spring based around the Frost Fury and the Mega Neon that we made. You can't have Christmas that a good old fashioned snowball fight. So we built this cool little snowball fight area and using the snowball launchers we can enjoy a little snowball fight against each other. Finally, go and join our Roblox group, The Picnickers. The link is also in the description. There it is then. That was our Christmas party luxury apartment house tour. I hope you enjoyed it. Obviously we put a lot of time and effort into building it. All for everyone to enjoy their Christmas party as one of the picnickers. So make sure you subscribe and become a picnicker and you can come and join us next year. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button. We love playing Adopt Me. So if you want cool home design ideas or tips to make your playtime better, subscribe now so you don't miss any of our new videos. Picnic players, we all play together.